So today's video is going to be on Cold Monkeys, a show that not many people seem to talk about nowadays for some reason. Let's begin the video. Cold Monkeys was created by Alan De La Pena. Yeah, um, I'm just gonna call him by his first name because I'm pretty sure I butchered his last name. One of the main inspirations for making Cold Monkeys is that Adam used to work at an arcade store while also attending college. He states that he only makes things that he's interested in. So since he has a love for video games, he created a video game based show. Uh, ran the UCLA arcade for like uh, four or five years. Uh, so very interested in video games. So I wanted to do a video game show. So I, it's only things I'm really interested in. If I became interested in, you know, ninjutsu, there'd be a ninja show. But there's too many already, so I'm not going to do that. This is how Cold Monkeys came to be. Adam was in the middle of making the pilot for the Minora team. He states that he spends a lot of time in animation editing. And during some of his extra time, he wrote a script that he really liked for Cold Monkeys. And later on, he made an animation test. The end product was a seven minute short. Adam also explained that a lot of networks were interested in buying Cold Monkeys, but ultimately he went with G4. Did you start this show as a satire or homage to early gaming culture? Uh, I started because I love early gaming culture. Um, I love history. Um, I only love the history of video games. I know of no other history. Uh, don't know American history, didn't do that. Uh, French, I guess, don't know that history. So just video game history I, because I loved it you know, so much. and. I just love the look of it and I thought if we could do a show like that that was really good, that was rooted in the real game world, that would be like the best thing ever. And what you have accomplished, Adam, thank you so much for stopping thanks by for and thanks to all of the virtual audience questions. And don't forget, you can catch the new season of Code Monkeys right after our show. Code Monkeys premiered on G4 in July 2007. The show revolves around a fictional video game company called Gamavision and its wacky employees, mainly the two characters Dave and Jerry. The series only lasted two seasons with a total of 26 episodes. The entire series takes place in the Silicon Valley city of Sunvale, California during the 1980s. Adam got inspiration for the 8-bit video game style from the Castlevania video game. He also mentioned that Dave is based on him during his college years. I love you whores! Fun fact, Cold Monkeys went through a couple of titles like Dave and Jerry vs. The World and another title simply named Games. The name Cold Monkeys came from the theme song created by Jonathan Colton, and Adam decided to make it the name of the show once he obtained the rights to the song. The show was made in-house in G4 Studios using computer animation. Some of the episode's premises involved poking fun of past events and being a part of gaming history, like the E.T. episode where the E.T. game was made around the same time, even had a rushed production schedule, which resulted in a bad game. Lord, spilled juice. Oh. My. God! It's not a problem. No problem? This game is horrible! Look at Benny! Bad man! Very bad man! Which also created the video game Crash in 1983, which became a future episode. Speaking of crap, did you ever play that E.T. game? Horrible! Hey, screw you! Owie! The show's guest voices consist of people mostly in the same industry. From Steve Wozniak, one of the co-founders of Apple, who appeared in the first episode. Adam explained that having Wozniak's guest voice a character in the show was like having Brad Pitt to him. David Jaffe, the creator of the God of War series, who appeared in the episode of One of the Gamers. Ed Boone created the Mortal Kombat series, who appeared in the episode of The Great Recession. And the greatest guest of them all, Tommy Chung. Who is it again, man? Dave! Dave's not here, man. Let me try. Hey Laird, it's me, Jerry. Hey Jerry, man, come in. Oh, who's this guy? I am so proud to show you guys my latest creation. I really think you're going to dig it and dig it deep. This is the women's spa. What? I ain't looking. But I am taking pictures. That place is where awesomeness goes to die. Can't take it anymore! Dave, are you sleeping inside a dead donkey like a tauntaun? Your wife is awesome. She has tiny, tiny hands, and they go everywhere. Not since Gonad the Barbarian has there been a game this great. Like a kid's ever going to play a Japanese video game. Oh, lucky like Fritos. Good lucky like Dow and Mountain Dew. Good lucky very simple man. Big born fuzzy secret heart. Damn it, Molly Ringwald! 
when we find out how many people are buried in your basement, are we going to be more shocked or more disappointed by the number? The ratings for this show's first season were pretty good. Around the end of the second season, the show just disappeared. At first, it was just put on hiatus with reruns airing regularly. Around that time, the G4 channel was falling apart with them laying off people, canceling original shows left and right. Except for X playing Attack of the Show, which just got downgraded for being daily shows so only running three to four days a week. Airing things like Cheaters back to back and Cops for some reason. So, what happened to the show? It was just on a shitty network that didn't know it had a good thing right there in its face. The reviews for the show were pretty good. For some reason, they never released a DVD for season two. I wonder how things would have turned out if Cold Monkeys aired on the Dog Swim instead of G4. Sorry, I couldn't really find like the latest thing that Adam's up to. He's barely active on social media, you know, um, when he's not shit posting. But he's possibly working on a new series, judging by this tweet. It maybe gave some subtle hints that Cold Monkey may be coming back. Or it could just be a troll. Can you see he loves you, bitch? I love you, bitch. I love you, bitch. I love you. Why does I free you and the end? The baby makes three. Baby makes three. The hot dogs in the bun, you best not.